hello so let's look at an MTU maximum transmission unit so I have a problem on MTU and let's solve it together so an MTU basically deals with the maximum amount of bytes that is transferred in a packet and in an Ethernet the maximum bytes that can be transferred is at 1500 bytes so let's look at the question now it reads a total of 1440 bytes that is routed through an interface with the MTU, the maximum transmission unit of 576 bytes, which means the 576 bytes is the maximum that can be transferred in a packet. And calculate the flag, fragment offset, total length, and data transmitted in each packet after fragmentation. And it also says assume the IP header to be 20 bytes. Basically, out of 1440 bytes, we are allocating 20 bytes for the IP header. So 1420 is the actual data to be transmitted so let's go to the solution so we have a total bytes of 1440 total bytes of 1440 and then since 20 is to be transmitted so we decrease the 20 it becomes 1420 and byte bytes to be transferred right and then we have the MTU the maximum transmission unit to be 576 so let's move on so let's let's make some assumption right here 1440 576 in each fragment which means we can transfer it with three fragments, right? 576. So the 1440 divided by 576, which roughly becomes 2.5, which means it, we can do it in three fragments. So let's write the first fragment. Now in the first fragment, as I said, the MTU, the maximum transmission is 576 and come back to the question it says to calculate the flag the fragment offset and the total length and the data transmitted so let's calculate the flag uh, you know it turns out the flag of all the fragment is one except the last fragment so last fragment will have the flag of zero and all the other fragment will have the flag of one so the flag of the first fragment is one next one is the fragment offset The fragment offset of first fragment will always be zero. This is because there is no other fragment prior to this. So there's no way to calculate the fragment offset for the first fragment, so it is zero. Now next one is the total length. Although the maximum length is 576, right? So total length is something we'll calculate later. And also the other one is the um, total data transmitted it's also something we're going to calculate later so you, let's move on to the second fragment there's a reason why I'm not calculating this though so the flag again is one because we, we still have one more flag fragment left now the fragment offset Now it turns out the fragment offset of the second fragment is the total data transmitted on the first fragment divided by it. Now since we don't have the data transmitted on the first fragment, let's try to calculate it now. So initially we have 576 to be the MTU. So now when we decrease 20 in here, okay, let's say 576 minus 20, it becomes 556, All right? This is the data. Um, that can be transmitted right so now the fragment offset to calculate this fragment offset I need to divide the total data transmitted by it so let me go ahead and divide 556 by it it becomes 69.5 so 556 divided by 8 becomes 
since this is a decimal number, I need to have an exact precise number as my fragment offset. So I'm going to multiply 69 with 8, which means it's going to result in 552. So instead of, since I decreased 20 in here, instead of having 556 as my total length, say total data transmitted, I will have 552 as the data are being transmitted here, 552. And obviously the total length now is something we add 20 to the um, to transmitted to get the total length right because I've decremented 20 in here which means it becomes 572 so maximum is 576 whereas the total length that is being used here is 572 this is because to calculate the fragment offset we need to divide the total data transmitted by 8 on doing that I got the answer of 69.5 Right to make a precise number of 69, um, I needed to decrease it roughly by four, yeah, exactly by four. So in here it comes 69. That is the fragment offset. So it is basically the data transmitted on previous fragment divided by eight. Now the total length again is 572. Why? Why not 576? Because I will get a decimal number if I have 576. And then the total data transmitted in this fragment is again 552. That is minus the 20 so I transmitted out of 1420 to be transmitted see 1440 was there but 20 is the IP header so out of 1420 I transmitted 552 in the first fragment and also 552 in the second fragment so it becomes a total of 552 times 2 it becomes 1104 so 1104 data has already been transmitted now what's remaining out of out of 1420 so out of 1420 1420 um, I have 1004 being transmitted so I have 316 data remaining to be transmitted right so in my third fragment now here I'll have the flag of 0 so we have 316 remaining so I have a flag of 0 because it's the last one and then the fragment offset fragment offset is we add the first and second fragments to all data transmitted and we divide it by 8 that is 1104 divided by 8 it becomes 138 that is the fragment offset of the thought now the total length length and total data transmitted right so total data transmitted as I said remaining is 316 right so 316 is the total data to be transmitted and total length is adding the extra 20 IP header that is 336 and there we go so this is the way to calculate um, the flags the fragment offset and total length and also the data total data being transmitted uh, in an MTU so in a maximum transmission unit and again let's try to recap we have a total bytes of 1440 but 20 has been allocated for the IP header so total data to be transmitted becomes 1420 and the MTU of 576 meaning the maximum data transmission per packet is 576 and the first fragment the, the flag is always 1 and fragment offset is always 0 because it's the starting one and then the total length I decrease it down to 572 this is because I wanted to have a precise exact number on this fragment offset uh, of the second fragment that's why I 
instead of having 576 I, I put it down to 572 now the total data being transmitted is 552 why 572 minus 20 equals 552 because 20 has been divided for the IP header on the second the flag is 1 flag one offset as I said becomes 69 total length again is the same 572 and the total transmitted here also is 552 and on the third the flag is 0 because it's the last one and the fragment offset is 138 how did I get it I added 552 and 552 and divided it by 8 and the total length here is 336 and the total data transmitted is 316 I got 316 out of it so I added this one and then it, it became 1104 but the total is 1420 so remaining is 316 and then I added 20 um, on this to get my total length so there we go so this is um, been a topic on MTU and um, I hope you liked it so be sure to like and leave a comment and subscribe for more thank you all for watching